Chapter 1.5, Thesis Structure. 1.51, Overall Structure of Thesis. This thesis is designed to serve as an open letter to the Office of the President, Office of the Secretary of Defense, Office of the Joint Chiefs of Staff, the National Security Council, and the American public. In response to the March 2022 Office of the President of the United States Executive Order on Ensuring Responsible Development of Digital Assets and the May 2022 Executive Order on Improving the Nation's Cybersecurity, this thesis provides an argument for why accommodative and supportive Bitcoin policy could be a national strategic imperative. It also provides an argument for why the Department of Defense should consider accumulating a strategic stockpile of Bitcoin. These arguments are made from the author's perspective as an active duty U.S. officer and a National Defense Fellow assigned to MIT to research the national strategic impact of emerging technology. This thesis also explores the significance of Bitcoin's proof-of-work protocol from a broader perspective of computer theory. It presents an argument for why Bitcoin deserves to be treated as something wholly different than so-called blockchain or cryptocurrency technology. It explains why Bitcoin is both physically and systemically different than other cryptocurrency protocols and is therefore inappropriate to categorize as the same type of technology, despite having similar semantic descriptions. This thesis introduces a new theoretical framework for analyzing Bitcoin called power projection theory and presents its core concepts in serial fashion, starting with foundational concepts and gradual building upon each other to arrive at novel descriptions I'm going to do that again. This thesis introduces a new theoretical framework for analyzing Bitcoin called power projection theory and presents its core concepts in several in serial fashion, starting with foundational concepts and gradually building upon each other to arrive at a novel description of Bitcoin in later chapters. If the reader skips ahead, they might miss important context needed to fully understand each concept in detail. However, each chapter uses the constant comparative method of grounded theory, repeating the core concepts presented in each section. Therefore, the reader will likely be able to grasp the core concepts of the theory no matter how far they skip ahead. The reader is encouraged to read each chapter sequentially and to revisit previous chapters as needed to understand core concepts. Each chapter is structured as a collection of essays on what grounded theorists call memos or what grounded theorists theorists call memos, which capture the core concepts of the theory and assemble them together according to similar conceptual categories and themes. The title of each section states the core concept presented in each memo. Because the author utilized the interpretivist approach to grounded theory, there is no separate chapter providing a literature review. Instead, the literature review is spread out across the thesis and is used to illustrate core theoretical concepts in a structured manner to provide additional conceptual density. If readers find themselves wondering what a given topic has to do with Bitcoin, That's 100% intentional. The author deliberately searched for anecdotes and diverse information that seem as unrelated as Bitcoin as possible. As unrelated to Bitcoin as possible. Typo. To add conceptual density to the theory and make it richer. A strategy encouraged by those who created grounded theory. Kudos to them. Each memo, no matter how unrelated they seem to be, is linked together by core conceptual categories. An underlying theme plays out and eventually 
culminates in a new and unique specification of Bitcoin as a power projection tactic rather than a monetary technology. The intent of this approach is to capture the complexity of this technology, address its wide range of socio-technical implications, and inspire researchers from across multiple different fields to research of, of different fields of research to derive new hypotheses to analyze in future research endeavors and their respective fields of knowledge.